it's almost October and it's the pumpkin season and that means autumn is here. I like pumpkins. In the US, pumpkins go hand in hand in the fall holidays of Thanksgiving and Halloween. I'm looking forward to seeing all the interesting jack-o'-lanterns during the Halloween. Look at all these different kinds of pumpkins. They come in variety of shapes, colors, sizes, and textures and serve a multitude of different purposes. What's this place called? Pantaleon's Farm. Pantaleon's Farm. Pantaleon's cool. Farm. All right. How much is the entrance? Uh, it's $10 for kids, nothing for adults. Okay. And then we also and have hay rides. Uh, the hay rides $5. Okay. For adults as well as child. And if you wanted to do a hay ride, a pony ride, and the play area, $15 per child. And you're selling the pumpkins, right? And then, yeah, pumpkins. So pumpkins, you can go pick your own pumpkins. They're, they cost per pound, so $0.79 cents per pound. Okay. We got these ones over here. They're $5. Small ones, $2. dollars worth $1.50. All right. Cool. Thanks. You're very welcome. It's 80 degrees today, and I'm up and about enjoying this warm weather before it gets cool and the autumn season. The main objective of this gorgeous day is to check out Port Jefferson. Port Jeff is only 50 miles east of New York City. Port Jeff is a beautiful village in the town of Brookhaven in Long Island, New York. It has a port that remains active as a terminus of the Bridgeport and Port Jefferson Ferry, one of the two commercial ferry lines between Long Island and Connecticut. What makes Port Jefferson so popular is not just the beautiful waterfront views, but also the accessibility of shops, restaurants, and resources in the town. You don't have to walk far in the village to find great places to go shopping, grab a veggie burger, or get a cup of coffee. Luda Nova is one of the many shops in Port Jefferson. It's a nice shop for collectors, especially those on the more gothic light. If one is a fan of plants, insects in resin, frames, glass stands, and maybe a little of taxidermy, then this is a store for you. I spent some time here going through their unique and tasteful merchandise. Before purchasing the grasshopper and beetle, I inquired as to the original source of the specimens. The vendor said the insects in their stores were preserved properly and prepared locally. Also, none of the insects' habitats were destroyed. I'm starving now and I'm stopping for a bite in Tiger Lily. It's a nice place and they have a good selection of vegetarian sandwiches. Today, I'm going to have a big veggie burger. I'm also getting a large pizza to bring to my friends who live not too far from Port Jefferson. Before heading back to Manhattan, I'm stopping over Raphael and Karen's place to hang out. Where's your sister? She's sleeping? Mm -hmm. Does she eat pizza? Mm -hmm. Is it? Is the pizza good? Yes. Zero to ten, how would you rate it? Nine and a half. Nine and a half? <laughs> oh, so maybe I can get some then. Nine and a half. Oh, you are. I really like it. I don't know how to like the pizza. I don't know how to like the pizza. I don't know how to like the pizza. Time flies when you're having fun, but it's time to go home. After driving through two bridges, I'm back in Manhattan. And now, I'm in my apartment. Yeah. That's the end of my
my video and thanks for watching. Please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you like this video.